CIG is clapping down. Before we get into this video, I'd like to let y'all know that I'm doing a giveaway for the Mariah Pulse. In order to participate, all you have to do is be subscribed and leave a comment in any video between now and the end of June. Let's get into the video. So um, starting with stars and alpha 3.23.18, CIG is going to be clamping down on the exploits. Okay, so the exploits that has been happening with the cargo um, where people are constantly spawning C2s and selling their cargo hold and logging off and logging back in. I don't know exactly how it actually works, but I heard that this was happening. So CIG posted a Spectrum post um and it, this one is by will soul crusher leverett and um this is the senior director of player relations okay so this is pretty interesting i think you should listen up we've completed an investigation into multiple exploits within star citizen that compromised stability and negatively impacted the in-game economy as a result we have resolved multiple auec exploits in 323.1a and we've identified and suspended over 600 accounts involved in exploitative behavior while also removing the illicitly gained AUEC from the Star Citizen ecosystem. 600 accounts has been suspended. Damn, that's big. That's big, man. All you guys that just want to cheat, man. Come on, bro. Just play the game and enjoy the game, man. You don't need to be cheating. You lose the will to grind when you cheat and get all this AUAC, right? You, you just lose it. You don't have any reason to log in anymore after you gain all of it, right? So I think you're honestly rooting it for yourself, to be quite honest. It continues to say cheating and exploiting undermine the integrity of our game and the efforts of our dedicated backers who help us build Star Citizen. We take these actions seriously and assure you that we will continuously develop additional measures against cheating and exploitation. We will continue to prioritize triaging exploits with the highest urgency to isolate and address these issues as they pop up. At this stage of development, exploits and issues like these are likely to arise, which is one of the benefits of open development and working closely with our community. Identifying, testing and Reporting exploits is acceptable and encouraged. We gain valuable insights through your issue council reports, and we thank you for that. However, once an exploit is identified and confirmed, continued abuse for personal gain will not be tolerated and will result in actions on our part. Man. <laughs> yeah, that's true. If it's identified and you know of it and you're doing it, yeah, they're going to clamp down, it looks like. Okay, so so once again, we are super appreciative of your efforts in flagging recent issues and your general support in utilizing the issue console. We will keep you updated as we continue to develop measures to ensure fair play. Thank you and see you in the verse. Man, so that is essentially it. They're clamping down on those people that were abusing the exploitation. Okay, so um, I guess this is a lesson learned. I mean, it, it's if we find exploits, it is fair to um, identify it and, and let CIG know. But once it's reported and it's, it's general knowledge out there, you continue to do it. I, I really don't understand it, right? If you just want the money like just work hard for it you know what i mean i mean i don't know I, I don't understand the logic of it um because at the end of the day you ruin it you ruin the game for yourself when you exploit to earn money in game because then all the ships that you work hard for have no value because you can just cheat to get the money to buy it right so i don't know those are my thoughts you guys let me know your thoughts on this down below don't forget to leave a like subscribe i'll catch you guys on the next one.